My name's Brad LeBrock. I'm a wildlife and astrophotographer. And today we're going to be looking at the Pentax range of cameras, specifically their astrophotography features. I'll be giving a brief overview from the entry level models right through to the full frame professional model. I've been shooting Pentax since the late 80s and they have a unique group of features that I don't think any other camera manufacturer covers. They are all fully weather sealed right up through the range. They're rugged, they're tough, they all have articulating screens and there is an amazing array of lenses that are useful particularly for astrophotography and that's what we'd like to look at the feature set on these cameras today. The entry level camera in this range is the Pentax K70. A really good starting point for most photographers. It can do all of the stuff that you need to do with your family and will grow with you as a photographer. We've got the 18 to 135 lens, which often comes as a kit lens. This lens is eminently capable for astrophotography. The next camera in the lineup is the Pentax KP. We've got the 11 to 18 lens on this. This one also has the battery grip on it, which just gives you a little more battery life, uh, which is actually useful for, for night photography. So moving up from the crop sensor cameras, we move on to the flagship model that Pentax do. This is a K1, and you'll probably notice that this one's a bit dinged up. This is actually my personal camera, and I've been using this for several years. This has been dropped off cliffs, left in the snow. It just indicates how rugged these things are. This thing is built like a tank. There's actually the K1 Mark II out at the moment. Both the cameras contain a 36 megapixel full frame. Now, the advantage of full frame is you obviously get much higher resolution and a wider field of view. Now, Pentax have built some amazing features into this camera. It has an articulating screen. It's often called the Lunar Lander. It's very handy for macro photography, but also for astrophotography. The K1 has an interesting set of lights that help with trying to operate your camera in the dark. Under the card slot door, for instance, you open the card slot door, there's lights inside it so that you can change cards in the field in the dark. The lens on this one is the 28 to 105. It is my go-to lens for a lot of the work I do. Very capable camera. All three cameras have built-in Wi-Fi. The full frame K1 and K1 Mark II, however, also have GPS built right into the camera body, which allows it to track the stars across the sky. So you can do much longer exposures and get great Milky Way shots without blur. The K70 and the KP don't have the built-in GPS, but you'll probably notice I've got a little module down here. It's fairly inexpensive. It slides straight onto the hot shoe and gives both of these cameras the same capability as the full frame beast. This GPS module gives you a highly precise location on the earth and allows up to five minutes unaided tracking through the clever use of the sensor technology. So I hope that gets you excited about Pentax cameras and the unique features that they have. I hope it gets you excited about astrophotography. Mm -hmm.